Hey friends, this is Atif Hope you're well and welcome to the new update on YFI token. Today the YFI token is hitting the $20,000 resistance level. It even it is breaking out the $20,000 resistance level. So today uh, we will try to understand that what can be our next target. For example, it has also broken out the resistance of the bullish pannon on the four hour chart. And what can be our next targets today we will watch uh, on the next targets, the immediate next targets, and we will also take a look at the long-term and mid-term chart targets as well. Before starting the analysis, I would like to recall this pattern again that I shared with you on 3rd of October that the price action of YFI token uh, with Bitcoin pair and with the US dollar pair as well, it was forming a bullish butterfly pattern. For example, this was the US dollar pair uh, when the price action was just completing the final leg of this bullish butterfly and I predicted that the price action will enter here and from this potential reversal zone it will be moved up as per Fibonacci sequence of bullish butterfly. Now I'm uh, playing this chart and it can be seen very easily that the price action entered here in this potential reversal zone completed this final leg and so far it has surged more than 180 percent and if we take a look at the Bitcoin pair that I shared with you on the 3rd of October, BTC, sorry. This is the YFI US or BTC, the Bitcoin pair. Then we can see that at that time, the Bitcoin, uh, with the Bitcoin pair, it was uh, forming the same move. And now I'm just playing this chart. The price action entered in this potential reversal zone, and now it is gearing up from this PRZ level. Now, if we take a look on the live daily chart, uh, the price action already formed the head and shoulder pattern and broke down the neckline of this head and shoulder pattern. And this was the resistance level that I was telling you that here, the price action will have a very strong resistance level at $20,000. And today we can see that the price action is hitting at this resistance. And uh, the price line has also broken out this uh, EMA 21 and 10, an exponential moving average 10 has also crossed up or formed a bull cross with the e, uh, EMA 21. So this is also very good support for the price action. Uh, so uh, and until we have this support, the price action can continue this rally and even can break out this 20,000 resistance level. Now, if we take a look uh, on this chart. Uh, here I told you that the price action has found a very strong resistance level, a trend line or rejection line. And today the price action is breaking out that, uh, that rejection line as well. And this is the ex uh, simple moving average 50 and this is the fifth, uh, simple moving average 25. Uh, now if we just uh, calculate the candlesticks, so we have 99 bars or candlesticks so far appeared as per Binance chart. So I need to place the 99 moving average with the time period of 99. Almost, it is almost 100 simple moving average, you can call it. So here you can see this red one is the 100 or 99 simple moving average. At the same time, the price action is breaking out this rejection line and also trying to break out this 99 simple moving average as well and from the downside this 25 simple moving average is moving up to the upside to form a bull cross with 50 simple moving average that can produce more powerful bullish rally now if we take a look on the smaller time period chart that is a four hour chart the price action uh, was moving in a bullish pattern and finally today the price action has broken out this resistance of the pattern. Now, if we place this trend line from the tail of this uh, uh, pattern up to the support and place it here, then our next immediate next targets can be up to at almost twenty five, twenty four, twenty five thousand dollars. I'm expecting up to twenty five thousand dollars because if we take a look on the daily chart. Uh, then here we have a very strong resistance of $30,000. And if we move back to the four hour chart, then here we have a minor resistance of $25,000. It can be seen here. You can see that here we have the minor resistance of $25,000. It has been working as a support. And after that, it has been working as a resistance as well. So it can be a minor resistance. 
But once the price action will be able to break out the $25,000 resistance level, then uh, on the daily chart, it can be easily seen that from 25, uh, even from $20,000 to $30,000 on the daily chart, we don't have any significant resistance. But on the four hour chart, uh, we are uh, watching a $25,000 minor resistance level uh, that can be a, a minor hurdle for the price line. The price action may hit the $25,000. And if that minor hurdle or resistance will be, will be broken down, broken out, then the price action can move further to the $30,000. And in case the $30,000 resistance level will be broken out, then the price action can retest the previous highest price, and that is beyond $40,000 as per Binance chart. So here, now we can set a risk stop loss. The different We can use the different uh, moving averages and their support levels that are, as our stop loss. For example, here we have the $20,000 resistance level. Today's candlestick will be the make or break candle for the price action. Once it will be closed above the $20,000, then we can expect that it will find a strong support above $20,000, but it depends on the closing of the today, today's candlestick. Then we can set a risk stop loss at the $20,000, and we can also use these EMAs as a stop loss. In my point of view, this trend line can be most appropriate stop loss for the for the YFI token because we have the 50 simple moving average just below this uh, trend line. And if the price action will retest the previous resistance and it will be failed in retesting and it will also break down the support, then we can expect a move to the downward that will be the same measurement from the tail of the triangle up to the support if we place here and it can be up to $13,500 that where we have the 200 simple moving average. So this was the update so far. I hope that you have liked the video. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. Take care. Goodbye.